Islam is perfect. Unfortunately, the people who practice it aren't. And I thought, yes, she's right. Anyway, I'm very, very happy to tell you that I did take my Shahada on June the 30th last year. And I have now joined what I consider to be um, the biggest family in the world. Just makes me so proud to stand before you today and say I am a Muslim. Thank you. as I was brought up that there is nothing after this life started to read the Quran and when it was reading the Quran which would change my life more than anything because I know it will upset them. They, they watch the media, um, they have a lot of preconceived ideas about Muslims, and so nice. I have to tread carefully and explain that it's still me under here. Alicia, hmm? what are they doing? I, I really enjoy, I, I love wearing it. Um, I know that I'm doing the right thing, and it's, it, it's, it's a progression in my faith. And it did feel wonderful being able to walk out and know that I've, I've got that lit, little bit closer to be, being the person that I want to be. sent to church on Sundays and we used to go there for Easter and Christmas. Akil converted two years ago. But and when I don't know, the Jamaican brother embraced Islam, it was like, why? You know, you're not Asian. I was just intrigued. And like whenever I used to see him, we'd end up talking for like two hours. Every time I had a question for him, he had an answer. Whereas I suppose before in the, the Christian days, I'd sometimes ask questions and I wouldn't get an answer. So that interests me. And then I began to read the Quran. The first thing that struck me is that it was very similar to the Bible. It talks about Moses, Abraham, Job. A lot of the verses in the Quran it ask you to reflect on your own existence. Look at the tree, look at the birds, look at your own creation, how amazing your own body is. And that in itself is sufficient for you to say, well, I'm something special and something special has created me. The more I read it, the more clear it became. But when you convert to Islam, every sin that you've ever committed in life is forgiven. So do I want to start off by committing more sin? No. Allah.